father son time because you know some of you say i got bad life and i just don't do be with my kid and all this other dumb shit y'all say about a motherfucker that's a bus and y'all didn't even know and didn't even say nothing to you um so i just got a question sir you got a mom at home boy. i did it um dr boyce watkins see i knew this was gonna happen see i knew a lot of the uh educated folk was going to be upset with me. And I knew a lot of, probably everybody going to be upset with me because my life story debunk a lot of narratives. And when you hear a man speak like me after you done kicked him in his ass for 20 motherfucking years, he still sounds strong like this. <laughs> I probably ruffled a lot of goddamn feathers. So let me take my big ass face up on this camera. <laughs> so. I just have to ask my brother, you for the people, right, Dr. Boyce? Now, why would you get on a live show without reaching out to me or anything or email or something? It's almost like you're giving them the playbook to take down my channel. You've said that over and over again, and that's the new narrative now. They're going to take down the channel. They're going to take down the channel. Instead of it being we the people and bringing your people in that's follow you, and saying, you're not going to take down this channel because the people have spoken and they like this dude. And we're tired of hearing the same narrative from people like you, sir, that you talk a lot, you get paid a lot. Where are the results, sir? See, I'm a result nigga. You can call me whatever you want to call me. Your opinion don't mean nothing to me. But what I'm saying is, I'm a result of what happens. I'm a walking, breathing Example of a free thinker. You can't debunk nothing I'm saying with your talking because my life say you a motherfucking lie and my mama's cooking told me so. So instead of you trying to dox a brother on the sneak tip, sir, and the rest of you YouTubers that tell me, oh, they gonna take your channel down. How you gonna take your channel down? Why don't you saying, why aren't you speaking power? You always talk about powernomics. Talk like you got some power. We not going to let this channel go, get down. You ain't even talking about the, the, the things that I'm saying out of my mouth, sir. It's sad. You buck dancing and belly aching too. That don't sound like strength to me. They might take his channel down. They might take his channel down. If niggas like you, let them. It's sad, but Dr. Boyce, I told you, and I told all of you, mama's cooking is watching. So why are you on your live telling them the blueprint on how to take my channel down because of a technicality? I noticed this is a technicality go along, get along game. Because of a technicality that I used the N-word that I changed to brothers. Yeah, it's changed now to brothers. Go look it up. Thank you for the tip though. Salute you for that, worm. And I was about to get into your life and what you decided to do and how you move. Because, see, I, you can smell it on me. And I think that's what intimidates you. You smell it, don't you, boy? You want to smell it? Go ahead and smell it. <laughs> yeah. That's sad, man. Y'all been fucking with an 18-year-old kid this long. And the motherfucker turn around and say, enough. And I said it quietly, enough. And now you want to do what you always do in front of the people this time, though. And I'm just a big enough bus to expose you, motherfucker. <laughs> you still think I'm crazy? While I'm playing connect four with my son, raising him in a household peaceful and quiet. Do you hear any noise in here? You don't want little black boys to be raised like this dude huh do your power nomics and all that talking that never changed nothing there was a brother black brotherhood that's sitting on youtube and send me the donation mama's cooking the more y'all talk the more y'all gonna expose y'all self 
I have done nothing but come to YouTube, speak the truth, and allow people to eat off my mama's cooking. And that's more than your loud talking ass ever done. And somebody proved me wrong with the results and not talking. Is it my go, son? Yes, sir. <laughs> mama's cooking. Oh, I see what you're trying to do, boy. Good move. I got a better move. Um, I got a question. I got a real important question. What happened to our elders? What happened to our elders? I was raised by an elder. And you know what he didn't do? He didn't dox a man. He didn't get on camera. He didn't stand on a man's shoulders. If he had no way of contacting you, he said nothing. He didn't get on camera and fake like he helped him. He said nothing. I know why you're talking, Doc. Because all that talking ain't never showed no results. And you scared just like everybody else scared. So you'll give a fake ass. Oh, I was just worried. And yeah, you worried about you. I'm worried about the people. That's why my YouTube page is open for people to use my video. Do you know how much money I could make if I just tell people to stop right now? You don't have no results behind what you're talking about. Just talking. I got results. Told you I was ready and prepared for you bitches. Didn't I tell you that? And I don't care about your pretty degrees and your loud talking and your glasses. I said this was quicksand. I said anybody can fall in quicksand. That's what I told you, didn't I? And I said, it wasn't going to take a lot for you guys to expose yourself. And I know somebody texting me, Doc, being on your side. That's because you don't got that eye over there watching over you, boy. And I got one. And what he said wasn't watching over me. What he said was not watching over me. If you couldn't get in contact with me, sir, you should have never got on open airwaves and said what you said. That was like the blueprint, what you just did. And what you could have did, sir, was be an elder to a younger man that clearly only been on YouTube and is lacking some of the skills that you have. And the elders, what they do is, instead of tearing down a young brother, when they see that he's on to something and the people are watching, they fill in the gaps. And they don't do all that little sideways hating. They fill in the gaps where a young brother don't have it and they build. But what I see now is all the elders are competing with the Young Bucks. That's why it's a disconnect. The Young Bucks got the money, you guys got the knowledge, but you want credibility and you want to sit up here and have the Look At Me show because you read a couple motherfucking books. None of them books you read changed a motherfucking thing yet, sir. None of them. But my free thinking ass changed my mama's address, sir. Did you? Did you change your mama's address to a golf course by a teenager? No, you didn't. So I respectfully, sir, the next time you want to help me and anyone else that feels like they want to help me, if you can't get in contact with me, please don't go over your airwaves and say anything that could potentially be used against me, sir. I think you're a doctor and I think your education level is respectable enough to know better. So I'm gonna hold you accountable for your education level that you should have known better than do that. So I'm gonna look at you like I thought I should because I told you mama seasoning is watching and mama cooking don't care nothing about because the people like you. But what the people don't know 
is that I'm the guy that's going to show you results, not talking and begging for money or asking allegedly, begging allegedly, in my opinion, getting a little better.